Hey everyone, my name is Matt. I'm a solutions architect here at Augment, and I wanted to share some updates from our product launch last week. All right, let's start with the banger. This one is called Suggested Edits. So I've got a class here I'm going to modify, um, and we can see here Augment's completions jumping in. They're easily influenced, so as soon as I start typing, I get a suggestion that's more in line with my intent. And once I've finished making those changes, typically I have the problem of what do I do next? Well, Augment has a suggestion for me here. And you see this hint to the right of my cursor says if I press command semicolon, it'll actually jump me over to another file so I can see. So I'll do that and I'm presented with a diff. I'm dropped in at the appropriate place and I can come in and I can accept this change if I like the look of it. And this process just continues. I, I really get to stay in the flow here. So Augment is saying that uh, 77 lines above, there's another suggestion for me. All of these changes are related to changes that I just made, right? So I can come in and I can accept each of these and Augment's gonna bounce me around different files until it thinks that the task is completed. So we see this as a really amazing abstraction. We're going beyond just completing a line or two or a chat interaction and actually Augment can help me accomplish the task that I'm working on. So we're already used to using Augment's chat to highlight a piece of code, a function in this case, and ask Augment for something. In this instance, I'll ask for error handling, and Augment comes back with some suggestions for how to do this. And you know, typically we'd have to then copy this code and figure out how to apply it to this file. Sometimes these code blocks don't quite match what we have over here and they're not usable. So when I press apply, Augment actually figures this out for me. So it makes the necessary changes to the suggested code block and then presents them in a diff. I can accept all of these chunks at once or I can review them bit by bit as I decide I like each part of the diff. Next up is instructions. Those longtime users of Augment may have seen instructions in Augment before. This is a new and improved version designed to really keep you in the flow. So no chat open this time. I'm working in the code. I make my selection. I press Command I. I'm dropped into this inline view where I can make my request for, from Augment. So I'll ask for a doc string. And then it'll go ahead and propose these changes in the same diff view and format that we just saw used with the apply capability. So these suggestions stream in. Um, and then I can choose to accept these chunk by chunk. Next up is more context, and this is an exciting one. So Augment focuses on the workspace, what you have open in your editor. Sometimes that might be a repo, and actually there's many other related repos we'd love for Augment to know about as additional context. So what happens when you click on this folder icon up here, Manage Workspace Context, it, is, it allows you to go away and, and do exactly that. So when I press Add More, I could go away and select that related repo, the back end to the front end and vice versa. Uh, if I've got a couple of microservices that are related to each other, I can go away and select all of those. Um, I could also pull in style guides or things like architecture decision records and be able to query Augment about those instead of trying to crawl through them myself. So let's say in this case, I need to start writing some CSS. I'm gonna add in the ADRs, then I'm gonna ask the chat, um, is Tailwind our chosen choice for a CSS framework? I think it is, but I'm not sure. So let's see what it says. Um, the ADR states decision to use Tailwind for these reasons. Great. Then this leans into another part. Are the AI models that these tools are using up to date? Do they have the latest version of Tailwind? Do they know everything about what that looks like today? Um, sometimes the libraries and frameworks we use have many different versions and these LLMs know about bits and pieces of all of them. Well, with Augment, I can at or click on the at sign and pick doc sets for popular libraries, frameworks, languages. And so I can focus Augment specifically on the, well, now my questions are related to Tailwind. And Augment is actually gonna grok over that documentation and ensure that as it answers me, it comes back with the relevant and accurate information.